Ninja, this is Tina and welcome back to my channel. <laughs> In this video, we're going to be doing our couple's nighttime skincare routine. If that sounds like your thing, then please go ahead and turn the notification on. No, I have to say that. So this video was actually suggested by one of my viewers and I honestly thought it would be super fun and also a good way to show you guys kind of my updated skincare routine. And Logan has been actually making really good efforts to keep up his skincare routine because you used to have like way more problematic skin in the past. Way, way more. So Logan always had kind of more breakout prone skin. Mm -hmm. What made the change for you? Ooh, that's a good question. I mean, I would probably say, I think the biggest thing is understanding how moisturizers <laughs> actually work. Oh, really? Yeah. Is that your actual, oh, yeah. cool. I was I like used... hinting to it being me, that I was the change in your I mean, life. but you're like the obvious. <laughs> <laughs> but that's cool, I never knew that. No, I mean, you are the main reason. Yeah. But, but you I'm... taught me that moisturizers, I don't know how best to explain it. Is it like you had oily skin so you didn't have to wear yeah, moisturizer? Yeah, my skin was oily so I thought if I put moisturizer on it would just like pack everything in and I would break out. And I think that's a so. huge mistake that oily skin people make. No matter what your skin type, you need to wear moisturizer. Mm -hmm. So that's your tip from Logan. And I learned skincare is for guys. Yeah, exactly. Anyone can do skincare. So let's get into the routine. Let's go. <laughs> so what do we do first thing always before we wash our face? Wash our hands. Oh, good boy. That is true. We've got some hand wash. Do a squirt. I was not even going to say this, which is bad. I mean, it should be understood. But it should be understood, but you know. Wash your hands. And then we... We put on our headbands, Yay! our handy dandy headbands. So we've both got headbands. It's mm. on this little hook here. <laughs> I'm the obvious purple and Logan is the manly green. Now, as I've said a million times in the past, I get these headbands from Daiso and I like them because for someone who has super long hair like me, I can just tuck it all up in there and it is out of the way completely. So after we look like <coughs> cute little boiled eggs, we're going to start with our skincare routine. Um, since I am wearing makeup, I'm going to be removing my makeup first. Cool. What are you going to start with? I'm going to wet my face and shave. So I'm not wearing a ton of makeup today. So I don't know if I should go with like a milk cleanser mm. or this one. The I'm from Fig cleansing balm I have been testing because I do want to do a review for you guys but the Cal brand milk cleanser is probably the one that I've been using Whoa. most days. Save this one then. What? Don't let them know about this one yet. Don't let them know about this one yet. <laughs> But this is probably the one that I've been using the most, especially on days that I wear light makeup or not wearing makeup at all and I'm just wearing sunscreen. This is the one that I've been using. Two pumps to cool. start cleansing my face and you can go ahead and wet your face. Shave, shave, shave. Yeah, I like to wet it because otherwise I got a little baby skin. Wet your children. You can't see. If I'm not working, like right now during lockdown, probably like once every three days, the better I keep it shaved, yeah. the less breakouts I have. So. I'd say that's a good tip. Shaving is a form of exfoliating as well. Hmm. Because it kind of like buffs the surface of your skin. Right. I am going to add some water to emulsify this cleanser. And then I'm just going to wash it off like a normal person. All right, I am going to use a bit of micellar water to get rid of like the makeup on my neck because mm. I did wear a little bit of makeup today. I'm just using the Rovectin micellar water. I don't have a huge opinion on it. I feel like micellar waters are all pretty much the same. They work. I mean, I will say it's hydrating, but yeah, I don't know. I'm just kind of like, oh, yeah, it's cool. It works, but it's on micellar water. Anyway, you want to cleanse your face. What are you going to use? I'm going to use this face wash here. This is... Kudere. Kudere. Intensive Moisture Care Foaming Facial Wash. Yeah. I'm not a pro with this link here. One pump. You can use one pump. Should I be using more than one pump? <laughs> <laughs> I use like two or three pumps. I will use two. I'm actually going to use this same cleanser because I've been using this quite a bit recently. Quite a while. Too. And you want to hit your T zone, right? Yeah. Your Tina zone. So I'm going to. Oh, we're like rubbing it. Oh, 
Did you see that? Yeah. Then you want to go... A decent amount. I just wetted my t-shirt in a circle. Yeah, wet t-shirt contest. Oh god. I do like this Curiel cleanser because it is very gentle. Fragrance free, alcohol free, free of a lot of irritants. Um, and it's made for, specifically for sensitive skin actually. Alright, we are double cleansed. You should tell. Thank you. And always remember to... Pat dry. Damn right! Make sure you pat dry instead of rubbing. Mm -hmm. okay. And then this is probably like only me. Tell me if you do this as well, but I always feel the need to blow my nose after I wash my face. That's I feel like there's just snot. Like, mm. comes to the surface <laughs> whenever mm. I wash my face. And I always feel like I need to blow it off. Maybe you're just cleansing everything out. Maybe. <laughs> I just need to blow my nose all the time, so. <laughs> So Real next, good. we're gonna hit the toner. Toner! What's toner. your toner? My toner of choice is carrot juice. <laughs> Benton Let, Let's Carrot. I didn't even realize that was the name of it. Professional. Let's Carrot Oil Toner. What do you like about it? It's orange. <laughs> orange First is and favorite color. drew me to it. I think it soaks in really well and mm -hmm. it makes my skin, it has like a nice So this one is actually like a, a nice... bi-face toner. It's an oil and water one. <clears throat> You can kind of see it. So it does add some moisture as well as hydration, which mm -hmm. is probably good because you don't do too many steps in your skincare routine. No. But this way you can get like both mm. moisture and hydration. And your mm. skin's definitely gotten less oily than it used to be. Yeah, for sure. Also, the added bonus that... It's carrots. <laughs> it's in a spray bottle. For me, yeah. it has to be in a spray bottle. It has to be in a spray bottle, spray bottle for Logan. Mm -hmm. The other toner he'd been using we actually just bought a spray bottle and put toner in it. It's just easier, right? I end up wasting it mm -mm. and I don't get it evenly. Mm -mm. Like with this, you can just... Anyone out there who wants to get your partner onto like skincare mm -hmm. and they don't like doing it or like... Simplify. Yeah, simplify. This is like literally number one tip. My toner is going to be the Tony Molly Wonder Ceramide Mochi Toner. Mm. So this is one that I have been trialing recently. I haven't like done it for super long yet. I've been liking it. It's kind of interesting. It looks very milky. Too. Yeah, well that's the thing. It seems really milky and thick, but it actually sinks into the skin so quickly. I feel like with a lot of other like thicker or milkier toners, they kind of feel heavier and kind of leave a bit of that greasiness or stickiness on the skin. But with this one, as soon as I put it in, it just feels like my skin's like... It just sucks in really quickly. Mm. Toner, like when I'm patting it in. Yeah. It's kind of like a treat yourself moment, yeah. I feel like. Yeah. Or maybe I used to just feel like toner was unnecessary or something. So now it's like a pampering yourself Yeah, moment. you kind of pamper yourself, you slap yourself. But you use toner like every day now, right? I do, yeah. Uh -huh. This is kind of random fact, you don't even have to put this in the video. Yeah. Before I did like a skincare routine, because my skin was bad, I didn't like to look at my mm -hmm. skin in the mirror. Mm -hmm. But it kind of makes you do it just because you have to look at yourself putting the yeah. the stuff on it. And I think you become more comfortable mm. just like seeing yourself that way. Because like every time I see my face, it would demote. I'd be like, ugh. Yeah. You know? Yeah. Look at your skin now. Yeah, exactly. I am going to go in with a second layer because I have dehydrated I skin. Two layers. No. Next, we're going to go to serum. The Ordinary. Nice sin sin cinnamon. <laughs> Ni <laughs> niacinamide. It's so bright. You, you might need it. to just pull it back a little bit. No. So I don't know how much you're supposed to do. It seems to be enough if I get it one like that. Mm -hmm. And I used to do it once in my face, but I struggle with that. Mm -hmm. I can't. I just take like two fingers yeah. and I go like this and just put it across where I need to. Yeah. A little on the forehead. If you guys have watched some of my past videos and know me pretty well, I do not like The Ordinary or I have not really had a good experiences with them and I didn't really like the Niacinamide Serum either. But I'll pull up some photos of how your skin used to be, just so mm -hmm. people have a reference. Mm -hmm. Obviously, as I said earlier, like Logan always had acne prone skin 
mm-hmm. and had a lot of scarring. Mm-hmm. You don't actually realize how much it's gone down until you look back at these photos. I didn't even realize, like, mm-hmm. even at the point that we met and stuff even. You have, like, no scars My charming now. personality blinded you. <laughs> Niacinamide is obviously one of the most popular um, and proven to be um, helpful ingredients for, like, evening skin tone, lightening scars, and help with, like, oil control and all that as well. So for me, I didn't have great experiences with it, but for Logan, it's obviously worked, like, really well. And that's probably the serum that you've used the longest, right? So I'm going to go in with my serum. I'm using the Number Zen Number 3 Serum. I freaking love the serum. I don't know how many videos ago it was that I did it, but I introduced this product. And I'll be honest, after I did that, I did stop using it for a while. But I noticed more when I stopped using it, what it was doing for my skin. Mm. And I can't even describe like what exactly it does, but my skin is just better and smoother. I just feel like I had way less problems with it when I was using this. And so I've gone back onto it and I've like used it for another probably like a week or two now. The texture and everything is really nice as well. I actually use it both morning and night because it's light enough to use during the morning. I will often layer two serums, but usually no more than two. What's your go-to if you were to do another one? If I were to do it, it would probably be this one, the Muji Moisturizing Essence. I've been using it in the morning though, and I really like this combo. This combo is really nice for me in the morning. In the morning, I use a bit less of a heavy moisturizer. So this one gives me like a bit more moisture by using two serums. And this also does have vitamin C in it. It's actually a really creamy texture. It just feels so nice. It's a really nice texture and it gives like a natural glow, but it also has like the brightening benefits. Vitamin C in it isn't strong at all. It's a very weak form of it. I'll try to find what form of vitamin C it is. I can't testify to how much it would like super help brightening and stuff. But again, I feel like my skin's just really even these days. <laughs> And it that. does seem a little red right now though, doesn't Mine it? Mine looked a little red just then too though. Yeah, maybe it's because we're just taking our time. Yeah, I just love this combo and I feel like my skin is just more even. Oh, <laughs> okay. myself. Yeah, you know. yeah. I feel like my skin complexion is just more even and I have less like noticeable scars and mm. stuff. So that's been my go-to combo. Next, I'm going to do eye cream. Oh, you moved to eye cream next. Do you do moisturizer first? I do moisturizer first. I do moisturizer last. I have been continuing to use the Manyo 4GF Ample Eye Cream. I believe this one had peptides. It's not like the best thing, but I just continue to use it mm. and I do like it. It is a thicker texture, as you can see. It's like... Damn, you use so much. Quite a bit thick. <laughs> and then yeah. I put it on my four fingers and then just dab it around. Mm. Well, I guess this is nighttime routine. Yeah. So this is the one I use at nighttime. Mm-hmm. But this is... Where'd it go? I do this one during the a.m. I actually like this one better mm-hmm. than that mm-hmm. one. Which I really yeah, like this one see. too. Good Molecules Yerba Mate Wake Up Eye Gel. So that's my go-to for a.m. as well. Mm-hmm. And then I use a heavier, kind of more moisturizing one. Alright, so this is this is how much I use in comparison. <laughs> I mean, it's like so so. And then lastly, we're gonna move on to moisturizer. I am using the Hadara Boko Kujin Premium Cream. If you watched my uh, recent Hazard Level Creams, you would have seen this one. It's been my favorite go to at nighttime because it's very <laughs> moisturizing and creamy and it just makes my skin feel like and then for me, this is the same company, right? It's the same company, Lava. essentially the same. Product. This is my Goku, Goku cream. Goku. <laughs> you are <this> so close. <laughs> it's <laughs> nice. It's smooth. It's light. Goes on easy. Leaves you feeling refreshed. Mmm, sounds like. You know what I mean? One. Yeah, I know what you mean. The smell is Japan. <laughs> I'm a fan of the packaging. Yeah. I will say, there's something about it that brings out like the inner collector in me, I think. Oh yeah, yeah. But that's the regular Hadarapo Gokujin that Logan is using, so um, they're essentially the same product, Mm -hmm. just... um, I haven't tried that one. Mine's richer. It's a fair bit heavier, so I like to use that one or even the Shirojin gel one during the day. This is the one I have been using during the day. They are more of a, like a gel cream texture. Whereas mm. the premium is heavier, it's creamier, but it works for my drier skin, especially at night. I want a little bit of that extra nourishment. This feels good on where I shave too. Yeah. Yeah, I feel like I've got a couple little spots. 
We took too long. Think about it. It took half I an hour so, to do yeah. our skincare yeah. routine. <laughs> That's the completed routine. That's how my skin looks. And then you get near the light, show your skin. Mm. And mm. looking. Oh, yeah. Mm. Mm. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> You want to show you off your shirt real quick? Yeah. This is from one of Tina's lovely subscribers. <laughs> is that cute? Good? Yeah, it's cute. So shout out to you if you're watching. Thank you. <laughs> well, I hope you guys enjoyed our couple's nighttime skincare routine. We're looking nice and glowy right now. Make sure to take care of your skin, but don't put too much pressure on yourself. Enjoy it. Um, do what works for you. And <laughs> I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye! I thought you were going to do it. <laughs> Mira-san, konnichiwa, welcome back to my treaty. La 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 la. How now, brown cow? Tonari no kyaku wa yoke takiku kyaku ka. Freaked it off. Alright. Alright, what's up? Ready? How do I sound? <laughs> I think you sound fine. Mira-san, konnichiwa, this is Tina, and welcome back to my channel. <laughs> <laughs> you hit one of the... <laughs> That's so funny. You know those pictures where they alter the person to look way bigger? Bigger? <laughs> 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 it looks gigantic.